Hello, this is Terrence Thomas of Physical Excellence Coaching. In this video, I want to share with you the difference between core strength and core stabilization. Now, you may think that they're one and the same, but they're actually quite different. But you must have core stabilization before you can build strength. It's almost like trying to uh, fire a cannon from a canoe, as Charles Poliquin would say. In order for you to have proper strength, you have to have proper uh, a foundation, okay? If you build strength without stabilization, you're going to increase your likelihood of injury. Case in point, let's say you can deadlift 400 pounds, but you lack the stabilization component to actually hold your position and, and, and really activate the smaller muscles within your spinal, spinal stabilization system, uh, you're going to have some problems because the outer unit forces are not going to be properly counteracted with the inner unit forces and when that happens it creates shear force in the spine and that's why you can get someone who can deadlift 400 pounds but then bends over to brush their teeth and throws their back out. There's a huge imbalance there. So stabilization must come before strength in order to maximize performance and prevent injury. Give that concept a shot as you go about your training and let me know how it works. If you want more information like this, go ahead and subscribe to this YouTube channel, Terrence Thomas, or follow us on Facebook, Terrence Thomas Physical Excellence Coaching. I'll talk to you soon.